someone paid $70 million for a JPEG file. So NFTs have become this sort of like breakout use case of, of blockchain technology this year. Um, I, I tracked down the URL where you can go, and this is still up, this is available, we can all go today. You can download it. You too can have this $70 million JPEG file. Saved you a lot of money. But of course, that's not why or that's not what people spent $70 million for. And this is the important distinction when you hear the word NFT. So what the person that spent $70 million was paying for was this. So this is the metadata associated with that JPEG file. This is what gets uh, created as a token on the Ethereum blockchain. And this is, you could think of as essentially the receipt that, that sort of describes the file itself. So, you know, anyone can go and download the file, but this is actually what gives someone ownership or the token associated with that file.